Roll Goal! Yeah, hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. It is the rematch of the century here. I've got a lot of rupees to burn, so let's burn them. <laughs> Oh boy, oh, this is, I'm, it's going to take me a little bit to get used to this again, but I will get both of these. Oh, 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 okay, okay, good, oh, what the heck was that? I don't know, but I'm still on, so I'm okay, somehow, oh, oh. I overtipped. curses. Alright, let's go again. We've got 684 rupees. It only costs five to, pl to play. Sort of like those nickel machines at casinos, but before you know it, you spend $50. <laughs> no, I've never gambled. Ah, oh, oh, poopers. But that is pretty much how those things go. Alright, come on. You can do it, PK Gam. It's just a marble. It's just a marble on a wooden course. Oh, poopers. I wonder if I should, in, like, instead of stopping it on a dime on that little plateau, maybe I really should just try and cut the corner, if at all possible, but I'm not sure if I can do that. But it just feels like that the ball only moves in lateral angles. See, like that? I almost had a straight shot to the goal there. If I, if I were just cut the corner just right, then... Oh, and now I'm failing at the early part of the courses. Well, early part of the course. Come on, it is three straight lines. <laughs> well, technically two are slopes, but still. Three straight lines. Oh. Come on, gentle movements. Gentle will win. At least until we get to these. Oh. And that's how she gets your money. She's like, oh, you're so close. Just one more time. Mm. <laughs> and then she makes billions upon billions of rupees. And then the entire economy of Hyrule goes into shambles due to roll goal. It's just an, a whole issue. And oh my god, I got it! Yes! <laughs> roll goal indeed! All right, one more course to go. I guess that's what I'm gonna have to do for the next one as well, because there's a similar obstacle to that one. That, that but except it's right near the end, and oh boy, it's not gonna be pretty. <laughs> or will it? Maybe it'll go better than I think it will. Because that, that went pretty quickly, I have to say. All right, roll goal. One, dash, eight, go! Look at this beast. <laughs> Doesn't look too bad, at least in the first three slopes, but it's it's still the first three slopes that can still get you that are very similar to the um, uh, first slope on the last one. Oh, see what I mean? <laughs> oh, this isn't going to go well, is it? Oh, 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 it did. I'm surprised. <laughs> All right. Careful, careful, easy does it, oh jeez, uh, 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 it's just a marble, you can do it, there we go. Now if only I could do that on the last one, you know, something that has such a smooth transition that's easy to react to, but alas, that is not the case. Oh, oh no, no, I'm not going to fall off this, oh come on, that was the easy one of the three. <laughs> Because there's, there's three blocks of, uh, well, actually four blocks worth of running room for me to overshoot t the target. Uh, ooh, not bad, not bad. And one more, oh god. One just, oh my god, I got it! <laughs> I, no, that's impossible! Impossible! <laughs> roll goal! Roll goal! Roll goal! Freaking roll goal! Yes! <laughs> yes! And she gives you the frog lure. And you can use that when you go fishing again. Um, I'm just gonna show you this really quick. Oh, I can't believe I did that. <laughs> 
it just, it didn't take much time at all. I, I, I put off roll goal for a while because I figured I would be spending hundreds of rupees and hours of time. Well, maybe not hours, but you get what I mean. It just would take a while. No, I just went right through it. Alright, now if you go check the courses again... She's gonna say that she has harder versions of the game with shorter time limits. Uh, every even numbered one is mirrored and the time goes down by 20 seconds per level site. So, so like in level... F <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> so in level 3 uh, it'll be 2 minutes and 20 seconds as opposed to 2 minutes and 40 seconds, you get the idea. And as as I said, even numbered ones are mirrored, so yeah, it's pretty much the same courses except mirrored and with less time. I'm not gonna go through these because I already showed you how to get through all of them, and yeah. <laughs> so I'm just going to stop here, and I'm gonna start getting some postals, actually. Um... I have still like 20 something to go. I, f I forgot the count. What does it say in my inventory? Ah, 28 more to go. Okay. You'll, you'll see the postal count here. It max is 60, obviously, because there's only 60. So, let's get the postal collecting, I suppose. This is going to take me a little while, but maybe not as long as the last time I played Roll Goal. <laughs> Anyway, I'm gonna wait till it turns night here and collect the uh, postal at uh, the Upper Zoras River here. So I'll see you then. It is dark out. There's our po. Uh, how am I gonna get that actually? It's because it's because this river has a current to it. Maybe what I should do is like switch my Zora's armor, Zora, Zora armor, and then zip over there. Oh yeah, this works great because I can resist the current with this. And I see something that's bombable down there. Maybe I should go do that as well. And mm, yeah. And whoop. hey, how's it going? Oh, we hit each other at the same time. Oh no, I, I, I'm hitting the wall. Or I mean, I'm hitting the ground. Wow. <laughs> and there's a postal. Woo! Uh, wait. Actually, what are these things? Oh, how did I? What? I, I pressed down on the one that was over here, and I teleported to this one. How does that even work? <laughs> hmm, okay, let's just... Okay, okay. Back to a human, and I'm gonna bomb some stuff in the water there just for the fun of it. Oh, I need my water bombs. And, oh, and I need my iron boots. Of course. <laughs> And down we go. This is kind of pointless since I already have a crap ton of rupees. But you know why not? It's just gonna be. Now completely missed the rock. Now completely missed the rock again. Apparently, or not. <laughs> How did that first one miss, but the second one didn't? I don't. The game's physics are not on my side today. <laughs> Uh, I got ourselves a trench here, I suppose. A roll a bomb over there. Now is that gonna miss? I didn't think so. <laughs> All right, let's take off the boots and go to the next location, I suppose. Wait, wait, what's? Oh wait, that's Isa's rapids, right? My mistake. Oh, whoa, 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 what is that? Maybe I shouldn't warp too soon here. <laughs> there might be something interesting, I don't know. I know there's no collectibles, like important collectibles underwater or something like that, but I just figured as long as I see the rocks there, I might as well make them go explodey explodey. Alright, next location. I warped over to Zora's Domain to get this next pole here, I believe. If you follow this path from the top here. You will, or... Maybe not. <laughs> I thought there was a pole in this area here. Oh, I see one over there. But I just wanna... Okay, so there's one there. And... I think there's one there. Unless that's just the water reflection. 
I can get that one over there really easy. Whee! Wolf Link is quite swift, even swimming. Alright, let's get up here. And, oh, there's our golden bug buddy. And here's our pole. Come on down. You're the next contestant on The Price is Right. <laughs> and there we go, another pole soul. I don't remember where that other one is, if it's not up there. Uh, wait, wait, is that it there? Maybe that's it there. I'll just use this path then, I suppose, to get to it. Maybe? <laughs> I can use Midna over here, right? Yeah, that's what I thought. Is that, oh, come on. Is it... Wait, is that something that I can bomb down there? That is something I can bomb down there. I'll get that on the way back. <laughs> um, grab something. There we go. Because I know this route is possible because I've been through here as a wolf before, of course. That was when the twilight was covering the land. Oh, geez, this is in an awkward spot. Eh, I guess not. <laughs> Alright, back to a human, if I can. Oh, okay. I was wondering if they, if someone would see me or something like that. And iron boots. Wait, is this something that's bomb? Yeah, this is something that's bombable. Just the camera angle made it look like a different kind of rock. Plop. It's probably just more rupees. Not that my wallet needs more rupees. <laughs> yep. All right, next location for Pose. <laughs> and we are here at Snow Peak. There's a couple of Pose left over here that I haven't gotten. I hope it's not going to turn daytime soon, because that would really, really suck. Wait, is that it? It looks like there's Pose up there in the background there. I don't know if you can tell on the... Recording or not, depending on your resolution or whatnot. Uh, but I'm gonna transform into a wolf and start making these jumps across the. Wait, actually. Ah, I was gonna say that water. It looked like it was frozen over, but I don't ever remember that freezing over. <laughs> I thought I would just try that for the fun of it. That's what happens if you fall in the water, by the way. <laughs> I didn't even bother, I mean, yeah, I didn't bother showing that the first way through here. Alright, and there we go. I'm gonna be exploring this place a little more thoroughly, of course, this time, since there isn't anything to, oh, hello. There isn't really anything to worry about, per se, uh, as, as opposed to before, when I had issues even getting through here. Is it? I think it is kind of daytime now. So I, I might actually be missing something along the way here. <laughs> I, 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 although, it was night in Zora's Domain, otherwise I wouldn't have been able to get that pole. I guess this is nighttime. It just doesn't feel like night, although, that does... It does have the feel of when it is nighttime in winter, because it is uh, a lot brighter, even at night, due to the reflection off of the... Off of the ice and the snow and stuff like that. I can't dash up the hill, really. Eh, 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 fine. Be that way. <laughs> uh, anyway. Eh. I'm looking for... Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. I knew that was a pole that i seen up there. Wait, what is... Is that another cave that I can enter? Like the other one that had that rare chew jelly? And finish. I might as well ex explore that cave. Did I just get frozen in the cutscene? Guess we'll see. Hmm. It, it sure looked like it. <laughs> oh yeah, this is another cave. Whenever you see a really large spot like that, I've noticed that it is a cave. Ooh! A place to use my ball and chain. Haven't used this in a while. This is great for getting rid of flying enemies, by the way, because it's above your head, and as they charge in for you, they just keep killing themselves. <laughs> oh, jeez, not you. Wait, actually, 
If I leave this ice thingy, this ice spire or whatever. Oh, if it failed, I thought I was gonna go right through the thing and hit him. Good thing I took off my Zora tunic, by the way. <laughs> I anticipated that by taking it off before I came in here. Ugh. Oh, come on. Wait, wait. You're gonna attack me, are you? Come on. Charge in. Oh, come on! It missed! It missed! <laughs> what blasphemy is this? Uh oh, that's not gonna be pretty. Uh -oh. You are trouble, you know that? <laughs> the range is just so large. Can I hit you from here? I don't think I can hit you from here. Well, I can break apart my last defense. <laughs> I'm hitting you from here. I just need to be a few inches closer. This is not gonna go well! Oh, it bounced it back. <laughs> the reward better be good in here, dang it. Whatever the heck's in here. I bet you it's gonna appear on top of those stairs behind them. If I go behind you, will you be able to attack me on top of these things? Probably. Hmm. Maybe not. Oh, there's a chest under that one. So I guess that's the reward. Ah! <laughs> Good playing there, PK Gam. Walking yourself right off the edge. E. E. Uh, and I just want to make sure that another chest won't appear in this room once I'm finished. Ah! Are they, do they kill themselves when they hit me when I'm above them or something like that? No, that's just me freezing and then breaking. <laughs> Is. Oh jeez! No! How annoying! <laughs> Good thing I have 19 hearts. <laughs> yeah. Seriously? I can't hit them when they're that close. Well, I can hit them when they're that close, but I mean, my skill clearly does not resonate to that. <laughs> and that's not a bad prize if I needed rupees. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. The last one is, if I recall, remember that, that cave that I had to dig in as a wolf? Uh, in order to see it, I had to use my senses and then search for the uh, reek fish scent. Uh, I'm gonna follow that scent again and enter that cave because I'm pretty sure there's a pole in that cave that I have to break one of those two ice, or I don't know how many ice things are in there. I think there was only two. Those two ice spire things in there. Stalactites or stalagmites, whatever you want to call them. And is the scent still here? I don't think the scent is still here. <laughs> ah, whatever. I don't need the scent, I suppose. Because I'll be able to see the uh, the dig spot once I come up to it. I just need to find... No, not you. Where is... I think I took a wrong path. <laughs> I mean, I took a wrong turn. Okay, go this way. Yeah, because that other way is a dead end. Where is the place you dig into the cave? How- or maybe it's it's much higher up than I thought it was? Hmm. Just guess I'll just keep going. <laughs> oh, okay, it is further up, because this is the spot that I had to knock the wall- knock the wall down by, um, uh, hitting it with a, um, dash attack. Where do I... Oh, even higher. <laughs> Exploration! Oh, there's the Howling Stone. Oh, here's the spot where you dig. Now I recognize it. Alright, now that we're in, we can get the last pole in the uh, Snow Peak area. Uh, transform into a human, of course, to be able to use the ball and chain. See these? I don't remember which one it is, though. Oh, a torch. And, ooh, a torch and the pole. Okay. These are real, these, uh, in my initial run through the game, I found these things really suspicious, so I eventually came back here and that's how I found this pole. And there we go. But I would like to light those lanterns to see what the heck they give me. Watch it be a treasure chest that I can't pick up <laughs> because I have too many rupees. Just watch. 
I'll bet you any rupees it'll be that. It's definitely not a heart piece, because I, I've cleared those out. Oops. Just want to put away my lantern to save oil. And it... Yeah, I'm not going to be, be able to pick this up, am I? Ah, well, you know it's here. <laughs> Alright, next location. Wait, actually, I'm... I've been recording for quite a while, so maybe I should stop here. Because I don't want to have another gold bug part where it turns out to be an hour. So yeah, I'm going to end it off here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part.